Welcome to How to Rock a Campfire. New episodes every Thursday at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Come check it out. It's going to be a lot of fun. Wah! 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 How you doing? My name is Dustin Cormier, and you're watching How to Rock a Campfire. I'm just getting my capo on my first friend here. Today's episode is I Am I Said by Neil Diamond, right? Uh, yeah, classic tune, and this song's awesome. It's just got this psychedelic question mark of like, you can tell this guy he doesn't know where his home is, and so, I don't know, like I guess he doesn't know where he's supposed to settle himself, and he knows he wants to feel... He won't, it's like, I think, therefore, I am. He knows he is, so I am, I said, to no one there, and no one was there to hear that he said I am. But the question is, is like, you know, like, if even if there was nobody around, you'd still be here, but the memory and the impression you make on other people is what you really are. And he's trying to say, even though there's no one around, I am, I am, I know I am. And no one heard it, not even the chair, you know, it's very poetic stuff. So, uh, anyway, I'm just going to get right into this one. Uh, so they start off with that little intro. So, uh, they do that here, and then there's also, you can have one person going... try to do is instead of going bum, 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 uh, you kind of you hit the E and then you mute it and then you hit the A and you let the A carry with the rest of the chord I guess I should say by the way I'm saying the chords as they are if you would imagine the capo as the zero fret and this is like an A chord that's what I'm trying to say so this is technically a B flat Right, because the capos here, but we're gonna we're gonna talk about the chords as if they're uh, in the key of A. Right? Then you lift that pinky, so you you climb up, and then you hit the G and the B string at the same time. And then you just hit the B string by itself when you let that string go, and then you go E again, and then A. This time you use your pinky to go to that third fret of the B string, right? And then once you do that twice, kind of interesting. I let that roll with the pinky doing the suspended fourth on the A. 
doing there is uh, the only confusing thing is the D and then the crawl down from the E back to the A. Um, so the timing is weird because they kind of kind kind of cuts out a beat here. So I'm just gonna count for you just so you can hear where I'm at. I am I say one two three four one two three four three four That's only three on that part right there, right? Uh, one, two, three, one. Yeah, sorry. One. So that's what, uh, or sorry, it doesn't go to that. It goes to the, I am, I cry, right? And then it's the same thing. I am, said I, two, three, four. When you think about it, they're in the D chord for technically seven bars, right? One, four, two, three, four, five, six, seven. you know you count there's four beats in every bar one two three four one two three four one two three four there's usually four bars per sort of like phrase or whatever you know one two three four one two three four five six seven seven on the D chord there, right? Uh, and that can be confusing, and that's just what it's all about right there. Uh, and uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, after the not even the chair, you kind of just do the spin forth and then stay there on the A. I am a cry. I am said I, and I am lost, and I can't even say why. And so when you go to the leaving me lonely still, he actually changes it up here and he does uh, the second part of the intro, he does first. And then the second part of the second intro, he goes like this. Whoops. That last note he hits is the pinky on the F sharp minor there. It's a bit of a stretch. right um, yeah you know second verse same as the first then we go through the whole same thing um, and then became one we'll accept the names and start the changes you talk about me the story's the same one 
Uh, I got left to this deep inside. Won't let me go. I'm not a man who likes to swear, but I don't care to sound me alone. I am a sin. So then it carries through another verse. Uh, and then uh, at the very end, I am lost and I can't even say why. And then you end on the A again. I am a sin. And then it goes, I am a sin. I am I cried. And then he does like that last I am that's kind of like with the, with that bit of passion that he does. I am. Uh, I am. And he kind of technically keeps going and fades out. I'll probably figure out some ending, you know. I'll probably just go, um, do, uh, down, down. Let's do the same as the intro, right? That's what I usually do. Yeah. <clears throat> right on. So that's pretty much the whole tune right there. And now I'm going to show you guys I mean, me playing it the whole way through so it's all one train of thought and not all scattered.
major seventh on the end of that song? Mm, I don't know. I tried it out anyway. <laughs> Gotta be creative, folks. Yeah, glad I got that one out to you guys. That was I Am, I Said by Neil Diamond. Um, yeah, I love Neil Diamond. I love the band and uh, the last waltz and that whole kind of crowd. They just remind me a lot of the same shtick that I try to roll with. And they're all super cool. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm Dustin Cormay for How to Rock Campfire. See you guys on the flip. Hey folks, just a reminder to check out my other channel, How to Rock Spirit, where I talk about everything under the sun, from astrology to mysticism to psychedelic yoga to practical materialism and philosophy too. Hope to see you there. Namaste.